Hey, what's up everybody? It's Jimmy here with Reinhardt Realty. Hope you're doing well. Uh, today I am in the Quellen subdivision in Waxhaw, North Carolina. Uh, there's two entrances to Quellen. One is off of Kensington Road. If you're familiar with the area, it's on that 25 mile per hour section uh, between uh, the Curitan Shopping Center with Harris Teeter and then um, the Waxhaw Marvin intersection right there where there's the church, uh, St. Matthew Church on that corner. So there's two entrances, one off of Kensington, one off of Waxhaw Marvin Road. Um, pretty pretty large neighborhood. There's a, there's a few um, builders in here. The neighborhood's 15 to 20 years old. Um, you've got homes from um, from Saucy Burbank, from Orleans Homes, and I believe, it was, I wanna say MI Builders. I might have to fact check that, but I think MI Builders was the third um, builder in here. But it's a beautiful neighborhood, and I'm just gonna drive through um and let you see it let you see some of the homes here so why don't i go ahead and uh switch this camera so you can see the houses instead of looking at me there we go so i came in off of uh, off of kensington and i'm on morehouse road here so today is july 29th so it's uh dead of summer one of the hottest days of the year and uh, it's beautiful this time of year with all these trees nice wide streets through here uh, this neighborhood does have an HOA uh, they have a pool uh, they've got sidewalks throughout as you can see they've got a pool and there's a really nice neighborhood pond as well so hopefully we'll get a chance to see that so lots of uh, all brick homes like you see um, to my left, you can see those homes over there. Um, pretty soon we're going to be coming into the section that Saucy Burbank built and you'll see a lot of craftsman style homes. So these are going to have hardboard siding, um, front porches, just, uh, I think they're really neat houses as well. So I've got a car coming by right here. We'll let them pass. All right, so we we're in more on Morehouse now. We're turning left onto Thayer Drive, and Thayer will take us uh, take us fairly far into the neighborhood. And basically, what I'm doing right now is I'm driving from one entrance of the neighborhood to the other, just so you can kind of get a feel for it. And we'll get a we'll go by the pool as well. So lots of cul-de-sacs. I apologize for the camera slipping down. I think I've got it secured now, hopefully. This is Denholm. I'm gonna turn right on Denholm. I believe this is where the pond is. I might get a look at the pond. There are some beautiful houses. Yeah, so that's actually, this is the access to the pond we just passed right here. I'm not sure how good of a look we can get it from this road, but we'll, we'll, take, we'll take a look and see. Yeah, the pond is pretty much over to the left, so. Yeah, so right now it is late July of 2021, and it's been a uh, it's been a pretty busy year for real estate. It's been an interesting market. Whoa, there we go. Let's fix that. There we go. Sorry about that. It has been an interesting year for real estate. Ah, uh, here we go. Here's the pond. Pond is over on the left. Let's see if we can get you a view. Now it's behind these hedges here. It's got a nice, large, beautiful fishing pond in there. Be able to get a look at the water fountain there. So every time I come through here, there's always people walking and running and enjoying these sidewalks. And you got some pretty good shade too with all these trees. So yeah, back to the market this year. So um, it's been definitely what we call a strong seller's market. Charlotte has been um, one of the hottest areas for people relocating, the Carolinas in general, and then Charlotte specifically. 
for people relocating here from all over the country. Uh, they're coming here for affordability, for better lifestyle, slower pace. Um, lots of times if they're coming from, say, the Northeast or California, um, uh, you know, good schools, good, uh, it's just a great area. You're, you're two and a half hours from the mountains. You're about three to three and a half hours from the beach, depending on which beach you go to. Um, and Charlotte has really grown up. I've been in Charlotte. I've lived in Charlotte for about 15 years now. I first moved to Charlotte in 2006. So I've been here for about 15 years and I've really seen the area grow. So not only, and here's the other entrance right here. Uh, we're going to drive past it to show you some more houses, but I've seen the Charlotte area grow, not just, um, not just, not just the city, which the city has grown tremendously, but also the surrounding areas. So we're down here in Waxhaw, North Carolina right now, which is about 20 miles south of uptown Charlotte. So you can actually take Providence Road, which runs right into the center of the city, head south, I believe it's 21 or 22 miles, and you'll be in downtown Waxhaw, North Carolina. So yeah, the, the area is growing. There's just, there's lots to do now. There's, there's so much more stuff to do, um, like culture wise, there's, um, more restaurants, obviously breweries have really caught on. So that's really popular here. Uh, but you have the arts, you've got, we have a great, um, great performing arts center in Charlotte. Uh, we've got a huge amphitheater. So we get all the major acts coming through. And here's the pool over here on the left. I'll pull through the parking lot. So we've got an MLS team that's going to be coming. There's the clubhouse. An MLS team coming to Charlotte in the next year. Um, they're going to be. They've already secured the name and the rights and everything. They're going to. They're going to start playing next year. And yeah, so Charlotte. Charlotte used to be known, and it's used to be known as a banking town, and it really still is. Um, one of the largest, I, think, I believe it's still the second largest banking center in the U.S. Uh, it surpassed San Francisco recently um, to go from third back into the second place position. Um, obviously behind New York. But you've got, you've got the banks here, a lot of banks headquarters, but you also have more creative jobs, more tech jobs. Uh, there's just a variety of different jobs. So we've got a really strong economy right here too. And and people are just, people are moving down here uh, for better lifestyle. Um, and like I said, better lifestyle, more affordability. So um, yeah, but yeah, Waxhaw, um, Waxhaw is a great little town too, which if you ever see any of my posts or watch anything that I do, I'm always talking about Waxhaw and the local businesses down there. Um, that's, I consider that my hometown. I actually live right on the North and South Carolina border in South Carolina, but my backyard neighbors in North Carolina, and we go into Waxhaw all the time. So, um, yeah, so this is hopefully I'm giving you a good feel for an Quellen. And my plan is to just drive through different neighborhoods and just give you a look. I just drove past a beautiful house. I'm going to back up so you can get a good look at this one. This yard, I mean, this backyard is, uh, is phenomenal. And this is right near the Quellen entrance. So let me, let me take this off here. Just look at that beautiful backyard. Can't tell if they have a pool. They do have a, um, looks like they have a back deck with an awning over top of it and just really, uh, really beautifully landscaped. And this is something, this is what really caught my eye too, is those, uh, those garage doors. Check out those, uh, stained garage doors. That is beautiful. That is a beautiful home. That's right here at the entrance. Um, right here at the entrance on Quellen. So we're about to pull out. Ooh. My, my blinker here. We're going to pull out. And thanks for watching, everybody. If you have any questions about this neighborhood, about the area, about real estate in general in Charlotte, let me know. I'm always here for you. Um, you can reach out to me directly. Give me a call, 704-313-8514. Um, check out my website. My real estate website is jimmygraponi.com. And I'd love to help you out. Take care. We'll see you soon.